I would do anything just to get you back again. I would do anything at all. I don't care about you and him. I don't care about what has been. I only care about your soft skin. Cause we're still sleeping in my head. I don't care and a very hot welcome here to Peachy. I don't know where you are in the world, but here in the UK it is boiling hot. Uh, 30 degrees Celsius outside and really as a girl who loves makeup, there is quite a few issues you can encounter in this heat. So I was thinking I should really show you my top 10 most amazing beauty hacks for summer for hot temperatures and all the other little problems that you can encounter during summer. So I think we should get straight to it. Hack number one, wear nude fishnet tights with hot pants. This hack doesn't necessarily serve those with absolutely flawless legs, but for those of you who feel somewhat uncomfortable about showing their bare legs in summer, but still want to wear things like hot pants or short skirts, I'm telling you, nude fishnet tights are the answer. They give your legs a very even and toned appearance, while still looking summer appropriate. Also, they aren't nearly as warm as normal tights. Hack number two. Use coconut oil on your heels. Summer is definitely the season for open back shoes, heels, stilettos, etc. Which however also means that our bare heels are exposed a lot. For those of you who struggle with cracked or dry heels, coconut oil can be really a game changer because it's an excellent remedy for relieving cracks in your feet and making them smooth again. Hack number three. Mix up light and dark foundation shades. Most of us know the trouble of getting a tan during summer and suddenly not having the right foundation to match your new skin tone anymore. Instead of buying 20 new shades of foundation for your various stages of tannedness, you should get an additional foundation shade that is much darker than your natural tone, pretty much as dark as you can get. And then by mixing it up with your regular foundation, you can always make sure to perfectly match your new tanned skin tone. Hack number four. Refresh yourself with a DIY beauty mist. Beauty mists are super handy during the hot summer days. Unfortunately though, most of them are quite overpriced. So this hack is a little DIY beauty mist that is just the freshest thing you'll ever experience. Just take an empty spray bottle and fill it up with some cucumber slices and some mint leaves. Top it up with cold water and voila, you have made your own refreshing little beauty mist. Hack number five. Soothe razor burns with chamomile tea bags. During summer, girls tend to shave much more frequently than throughout the rest of the year, which can leave areas of the skin irritated and red, which in return doesn't look great. One good hack to avoid that is to take freshly boiled chamomile tea bags, let them cool down, maybe even put them in the fridge or something, and then place them on the shaved areas. This will soothe the skin before it has the chance to get inflamed and hence will give you a nice healthy appearance. Hack number six. Use powdery products or products that dry completely. Another great summer beauty hack is to exchange your creamy products with either powdery products or products that dry completely. Since during summer we tend to sweat a lot more, creamy products tend to smudge or be eradicated very quickly. So especially for things like eyeliner or maybe also lipstick, I recommend either liquid eyeliner that dries out completely or just line your eyes using black eyeshadow. This decreases your chances of looking like a panda bear at the end of a hot summer day. Hack number seven, DIY exfoliator for better shaving results. When we shave very frequently, such as it is the case during summer, exfoliating becomes crucial because not only does it remove dirt and dead skin cells from the surface of the skin, it also helps you achieve a closer shave. Here is my favorite DIY exfoliating hack. Just mix three tablespoons of olive oil, two tablespoons of honey and half a cup of sugar together and then massage it onto the area you want to shave, for example your legs. Then wash it off and shave as usual. I guarantee you, your legs will feel super smooth afterwards. Hack number eight, mattify oily areas with blotting paper. 
Especially during hot summer days, we tend to produce much more facial oils and sweat, which first of all messes with our makeup and second of all can give us really shiny patches. I recommend treating those oily areas with blotting paper rather than constantly reapplying powder. Blotting paper takes the grease away as opposed to adding additional product again and again. Because especially during summer, makeup shouldn't look too cakey. Hack number 9. Use fake tan in your face instead of foundation. This next hack is something I absolutely swear by for summer and that works very well especially for pale people. Instead of wearing heavy foundation that is anyways probably gonna smudge during hot days, I like to apply face tanner the night before and then skip the foundation routine completely afterwards and just apply some translucent powder on top of my bronzed face. The fake tan looks super healthy and fresh, it even covers little rednesses and most importantly it won't smudge all day. Hack number 10. Use waterproof mascara. Yes, I know, this is a very obvious one, but I feel like a lot of people still don't really think of it. Waterproof mascara is going to be your best friend during summer, not only when you actually go swimming, but also in general when the air is very humid, you sweat a lot, you work out, whatever it is. In this day and age, I think there is no need to look like a panda bear anymore during summer. So guys, get yourself some waterproof mascara. All right, my lovelies, that was it for me today. I really hope you enjoyed this video. Um, I really do use all of these hacks during summer and they have helped me a lot. And I really hope it's the same for you. If I, however, have forgotten one hack that you always use, that you swear by during the hot months, definitely let me know in the comment section. And otherwise, me and Petteri are going to say goodbye and we're gonna wish you the most wonderful next week. Me and Petteri. We're going to the to the beach, at least in our dreams right now. <laughs> and yeah, that's it for me. Have a good week. Bye bye. I love you.